Hi, I'm Brandy. This is Hound Dog Hollow, and today I'm going to be unboxing my Witch's Moon Box for January 2020. I'm a little bit sick, my voice is getting ready to go out, uh, but I wanted to catch up because I was so behind. <laughs> so let's check it out. Alright. Alright. Magnetic North Pole. I am flexible but consistent. I am magnetic. I know my purpose, my true north. Beautiful. Let's just see what the theme is. Bridget's Flame. It's probably going to be things I can use for in bulk, which is coming up. Uh, Awoken Flame. So that's probably the candle incantation. Ooh, Wheel of the Year. Beautiful. Lovely, 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 lovely. Look at that. I love that. I love their art. And of course, we got Bridget. Very cool. Wow. Oh, wow. Oh, beautiful. I love boxes. Sometime I'm going to have to give you guys a peek into my um, realm over there, my witch's cupboard, because I have a lot of these and they're all full of different beauties, but I love this one. This one feels nice and sturdy. Who doesn't need another box, ladies? Come on now. Oh my god, it's got magic in it. Okay, let's get you back. Here you go. So it's got jasmine, and it's got, this looks like a tiger's eye, and it's got a, my candle, absolutely freaking beautiful, love it, 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 everything else is just icing, liberitas, ooh. Ooh, smell good. Smells like tea. Like white tea. Mmm. Lum. I can't smell very... Like, I can smell if it's like a, um, a strong scent or close to my face. But mild scents, I really have to try. So I can't smell the box, per se. And when I get close to things, I can kind of smell them. Bridget. All the goodies floating inside. I could smell cinnamon fire. Oh yeah. It smells like a red hot bay leaf. I'm just kind of crumbled. So I got two candles because this one's the oh and it's pink. Oh, it's red. Bright red. Mmm, and I love the beeswax well. Oh, wow. Big, huge cinnamon sticks. Mmm. Mmm. Just absolutely loving this box. Wow. Solar torch incense. I love these containers, by the way. Machine, which is of course all spice. Yep. Oh, look at you! Got this like little looks like a triquetra. Pretty, pretty. Oh, we got something here too. This is a really nice box. Is it an orange calcite? I don't know. I don't have to read it. Oh, we even got a spray. Wow. There were some people who were like, I'm not getting my oils and sprays, I remember. And I'm like, oh, I 
have so many. <laughs> Bridges Flame. Smell it. It's very cinnamony. It's good. It smells like really strongly of cinnamon. So, let's check her out, shall we? Bridges Flame. As we pass through the winter solstice and welcome the returning sun, we begin again. We celebrate the light half of the year that starts to unfold and give thanks for the knowledge and information we have received from the darker months. We are more practiced and evolved from our earlier spirits, having more control over the manifestations that we work to bring forth. This is a very sacred time for us as we dive into the seasons of growth and abundance, working with energies that bring strength and conviction to our intentions. We take full advantage of the fiery and creative aspects of ourselves, tending to the passionate flame that continues to burn. In this very special collection, we work with the energies of Bridget. The power and promise that is included within these items are created as a source to reignite your creative and uncompromising self as you walk your truest and most intimate path. Hand carved Celtic cross box, which is this. Beautiful. Um, let's see. Um, mini white intention setting candle. Uh, jasmine flowers. Tiger's eye. Cool. Bridget's hammer, fine pewter pendant with cord. Oh, it's Bridget's hammer, but it looks like a triquetra. But it must. Let me keep reading. Let me keep reading. With a sacred flame that is associated with the winter squatters or creative forces. Uh, through artists, practitioners, poets, and writers. The hammer for Bridges blacksmithing, although used to destroy, is truly equipped to work towards creation. The triple knot, resembling the triple goddess, also known as the triquetra or trinity knot. So, yeah, it's both. It's a hammer with that on it. Cool. The artwork, um, the hand that rolled and anointed a woken flame candle. Um, so it's enchanted with cinnamon, anise, clove, and grapefruit oils. And fire magical oils. Cool. It's about getting like fire energy. Whoa, oh, okay, there it is. I was like, <coughs> pardon me. Large cinnamon stick bundle. Uh, Bridget Magical Anointing Oil, which is like clove, anise, cinnamon, orange, almond, and bay with cinnamon chips and crushed bay leaves and the Lemurian quartz. Bridget's Flame Ritual Aura Spray. Which is um, cinnamon, clove, almond, true and true magical oil. <gasps> Pardon me, my throat's getting really tired. <coughs> <coughs> Pardon me. Liberata sacred salt. Sacred salt releasing stagnant energies we have held on to in the past. As we set off on a new journey this year with new ideas and challenges will push us forward to new opportunities to new opportunities and growth. It's important to continually work on washing away anxieties of old so that we can make new first fresh wake way first fresh experiences. That's got rosemary, sweet orange, tea tree, as well as rosemary, eucalyptus, and jasmine. It's also got a clearing magical oil. Solar torch, ritual incense, large tumbled sunstone. That's what it is, a sunstone. Um, all spice, crushed bay leaves, wheel of the year, book of shadows art, personalized oracle reading, 
It's from the Earth Power Oracle deck. Parchment paper. Which is this? I love it. This is a very nice box. I especially love the box, obviously. Um, but I like these cinnamon bundles. I love the artwork, the candles, the incense. Um, these smell great. Uh, very great. I love this box, though. This is probably my very favorite. I love this box. I have. I love having little boxes full of magic. It's super enchanting to me. Um, you know, Witches Moon, they do a good job. I really like them. Uh, I'm not... Bridget is not my goddess. I don't have... I don't follow Celtic mythology. Um, or I don't connect with them like that. Uh, but it's still lots of really good items. I like it very much. Pardon me. I'm so sorry, guys. <laughs> <laughs> I'm fading fast. I love this box, obviously. It's been a couple of years now. So, as always, please like, comment, and subscribe. I'll have the information linked below for The Witch's Moon. Uh, check them out. Uh, there's something for everybody there. I don't think you'll regret it. Um, anyways, I uh, love you guys so much. Uh, thank you for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll talk to you soon. Bye.